I'm here in the kitchen of my friend here, Chris Murray, who you've known on the show before. How you doing? Hi, Chris. And you're going to show us how to make... Marijuana butter. <laughs> yes. Okay. And this is actually because I find, for my own part, that I have uh, a hard time smoking it. You're filming the cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> it was very good pop. We haven't tried the recipe yet, so I'm not quite sure how uh, good it is, but the camera work is certainly indicative of something. Um, yeah, so, uh, yeah, I'm having difficulty smoking, and uh, I think smoke, uh, eating it provides an interesting way of ingesting it uh, as far as the... Uh, I'm just going to... What am I trying to say here? Eating it is a good alternative. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Okay, what, how do you make pot yeah. butter? I pretty much, um, I take shake. Take shake. shake from, how much you know, shake is in there? I don't know. That, that much. Your... <laughs> that much. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to... A couple of bushels. <laughs> you can get this bottom stuff, because this is actually good stuff. I take okay. a couple of handfuls. A handful of shake. I have, a, okay. I have heated water here. Okay, what temperature roughly? Um, it's on the crock pot setting of high. Okay, <laughs> so it's not boiling, it's just... It will boil once I put the butter and stuff in there. Oh, um, really? Okay. But I take and I put one. Mm -hmm. Two. Mm -hmm. Now I'll take some of this leafier stuff and just add that in a third bunch. Mm -hmm. There you go. Put that around like that. Is the chef to be in videotaped? Yes. yes, this is going to be on TV, actually. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> public access TV. <laughs> well, TV. Yes, yeah, still, but it's just for San Francisco. Yeah. So yeah. In the middle of the... Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 So, so how much butter should we use? I'm using a pound of butter for this. Okay. Is, is it salted, unsalted, organic, inorganic? This is unsalted. Or? Okay. It's unsalted butter. Okay. Um, I have heard you could also use margarine if you wanted, or um, or um, there is also a vegetable shortening or vegetable oil recipe, but I have never made that. So. Okay. I, I believe my boyfriend makes something with coconut oil, which is, and he also makes a ganja ghee, which is slightly similar but different. Well, that's so. what you end up getting from from this. Is ghee is what they. It's actually it's ghee. Yes. Okay. Oh. And I just put this in there. A pound? Is that a pound? That is a pound. Good heavens. It's like the whole uh, cardboard thing. Uh-huh. It says net weight, uh, four, four ounce sticks. Well, good heavens. I think that's about a, buy a pound. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that? I believe that's what I said. Yeah, I believe it was. <laughs> Quick, okay. we'll get our fact checkers to check that. Okay. <laughs> I put that in the recycling. Thank you for pointing that out to us, Mr. Murray. You're welcome. Okay. Whoops. I need to rinse. Oh, uh, just kind of stir this to get all the everything submerged. Okay. And I cover it. Okay. And let it get to where it's boiling. Mm-hmm. And then once it's boiling, I will turn it down to the low setting. Ooh. And so I think setting. should that be the low setting or the low setting? The low setting. That's yes, the low. The down low setting. Down to the low setting once it's boiling and the butter is all melted and you let it simmer for four hours. So let me ask you, what happens if you don't have a crock pot? You can do it on the stove. You just have to be a little bit more attentive to it. And, Let's see. Um, you know, make sure that it doesn't boil the water out too fast. And once you get this pot butter, what do you do with it then? Um. <laughs> Turn it into these. <laughs> cookies. Ooh, cookies. Chocolate chip. Do you like one? <laughs> I'm not sure if I should, after all. <laughs> it is a family show. Oh. Mm, Thank you. good. I wonder if they'll be showing this at APD Bryant when they're sitting in jail. <laughs> so four hours, okay. So you let this go for four hours, and then you strain it. But which is you let this go for four hours, mm -hmm. then you add an ounce or two, a shot or two of vodka, mm -hmm. and you continue to let it simmer for uh, another 30 minutes, mm -hmm. and then you can strain it. Ah. And um, 
I usually just use this uh, uh, colander. Mm -hmm. um, the screen ones work very well, especially if it's fine ground stuff, which some most of this mm -hmm. is. Um, it gets all the solids out of the, the leaf out of it, thus producing um, cookies that do not irritate your stomach as much. Because um, if it's got the leafy stuff, it irritates your stomach. Yeah, like the, it's mm. it's very coarse and it's mm. not it's not like eating salad. Okay, it's it's. Um, it's like eating rope, you know, basically. So in other words, you strain this after... You, okay, so summarize one more time the process is you put it in four hours later, you then strain it, right? You do a shot, you do a shot of vodka in before you strain it, half an hour. Yeah, like a half hour before you turn it off and then mm -hmm. you strain it. Right. And then it's going to go in, you strain it into, you don't strain it like down the drain because then you lose it all. Okay. You strain it into a, a pitcher or, or um, a bowl, plastic okay. bowl, metal bowl. Okay. And then you put that in the refrigerator mm -hmm. and what happens is the butter floats to the top mm -hmm. and it turns to a solid and then mm -hmm. you can poke a hole in that, drain the water out, mm -hmm. take, take the butter out. Eventually, you have one already prepared. You have this. Oh, wow! Green butter. Ooh, that's beautiful. And um, as a matter of fact, what we should do is actually remove the clock and like wind it forward like 24 hours or like 12 hours, and we're gonna pretend it's 12 hours later, and then that be like the finished result of that. Yes, but then we're missing the whole screening process. Uh, oh, you're right. Okay. Okay. No alcohol. flavor difference with so it doesn't matter what kind of alcohol. See, alcohol you use. basically burns out. And, yeah, yeah, it's just that like I don't want to be on. You're not on. You're off camera. Wait. It's so nice. My brother-in-law has a aviary in his house. It's so cool. No. Okay, we got it to boil. Fine. Just a second. Oh. What have we got in the pot then? Um. So Hola. Well, it was boiling a second ago. Right. But I disturbed it. Yes. And all I've done is really I good. have taken this and I've turned it to low. Wow. Giving it a little shizzle. So you basically cook it for until it reaches boiling, right? Yeah. In cook it until it reaches boiling. Okay. So that would be hot water, water, actually. Okay. Warm water doesn't yeah. boil. Yeah. Right. That's right. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, you <laughs> okay, what did I go? Okay. Put the lid back on and let's see. At 10 o'clock at night, should be about ready for straining. Okay. This However, point. you know what I could do? Oh, no. Hmm. Yeah, that won't work either. But yeah, I'll just go ahead and strain it and I have to miss the straining process.